P3 today. Uh, you said you made uh, a few, you didn't quite feel what was happening there in, in Q3. Uh, talk to us a little bit about what happened out there today. Yeah, just uh, another clean lap in uh, Q3. Just uh, some odd mistakes uh, which haven't happened in a long time, so not a good lap. But nevertheless, we're still up there, you know, and I think we have a, a good race car. So uh, it's hopefully going to be an exciting one tomorrow. Without a shadow of a doubt. Um, and I'm sure uh, a lot of people have been speaking to you about the fact that you guys now have two cars against one. It's kind of uh, a reverse of what it was in Bahrain. So you guys have got strategy on your side. Yeah, but so we, we all need a clean start and a lot of things can influence the, um, you know, what, what's happening on track. So we just uh, have to wait and see what's going to happen tomorrow. But it's good to have the cars there on the grid. And then, um, yeah, we'll, we'll see. We, and, uh, you know, we'll just follow what's happening during the race. Um, but, yeah, like I said, hopefully it's just going to be exciting. Did the pace of Lewis surprise you at all today? N no, but I knew they were going to be very close and I knew that it was going to be close in qualifying. Um, so, yeah, to be that close uh, at the end in Q3, even with the lap I had, um, yeah, in a way is, of course, disappointing to not get pole position. But on the other hand, um, yeah, we have to hunt again now in, in, uh, in the race.